25 inch overhead high voltage sweep uh, most people like to discharge this thing I don't even bother discharging it what I do is I use a chopstick I take the fat end of the chopstick I file it kind of flat like a fingernail then I simply stab it underneath there and in some cases you could pop it up if you can't just like that pops right off this is how you put it back on you bend it like this you bend it like this you lay the rubber on the glass about four inches away from this hole you make the, the metal touch the glass you slide it over until the metals in there then you bend it backwards a little bit until it grabs it now I'm going to show you why you have to bend it backwards bend it backwards because this is a little springy device it's like two hooks fish hooks that go outward and they catch this hole in the tube the glass okay so again you bend it back so when this thing a, a little spark will shoot from here to here when we get close enough if this was charged up okay so like right when I get about this close it'll go zap zap just real small sparks but it, it wants to go from here to here it also wants to go to your thumb but it can't go around the corner okay so we stick that in there stick that in there let it go you're done so here's again when you take it off let's say you can't pop it off sometimes they're stubborn or they've been on there forever you need to bend it up just like we did the opposite of what we did you need to grab the rubber so it can't grab you push on it push it sideways and then roll it out just like that okay you're not going to get zapped from that you're going to get zapped from that okay there you go now we're going to do another one okay this is a ceronics it's a 1493 or 1492 it does the exact same thing 1492 is the ceronics type of board we're going to do the same thing but I'm just going to show you on a ceronics it's a little actually it's a little bit harder even though the rubber is a little more flexible I do this I go in I bend it back on the ceronics board and then I basically push it push the whole thing this way and then I roll it out and then I come back it comes out just like that I don't even discharge it we put it back in it's a little different than the other one I again I lay the rubber on the glass lay the metal on the glass I slide it across till I feel the first prong go in let me show you the prongs real close see the prongs they're a little springy okay so we push it across the prong goes in I take my chopstick I push the other hook so it collapses together push it in the hole so it grabs it. Ta da. Okay? One more. We'll show you one more. 27 inch F4, F5, or F5 AT. They're all the same. They all use the same flyback. Okay? It's so really the same as the 25 inch, but I'll do it one more time for you. Okay? Basically, you put it in like that, you bend the thing up, and then you bend it and roll it, and it comes right off. Didn't discharge it, don't have to discharge it. And I had this on a little while ago. Again, put, the, put it back on the glass, slide it over. That's my telephone. One of you guys are calling me. And now it's back on.